Our non-governmental organization, Think Nigeria Christian Muslim Movement, is advocating, advocating what it calls institutional revolution through tolerance, statesmanship, honesty, and commitment to the unity of Nigeria. The leader of the movement and president of the Christian Association of Nigeria, Pastor Ayo Orishajafo, says recent conflicts arising from differences based on religion has made it necessary to foster greater understanding in Nigeria for lasting peace. At a conference in Abuja, the group called for a stop to the misconceptions the adherents of the two main religions have of each other. Think Nigeria always and not your tribe, ethnicity or religion. That is a central message members of this group, the Think Nigeria Christian Muslim Movement, is pushing forward to Nigerians. Made up of key persons in the Muslim and Christian domains, this Nigerians say the major issues the country faces have been along two hard lines, the Muslim and Christian religions, a situation where false impressions of each other have persistently brought conflict while religion has become an agent of wickedness and division instead of unity and love. Nigeria can be great if the over 160 million of us resolve to be one another's keeper. This means that we Muslim Christians will surmount the obstacles on Nigeria's path to justice, unity, and peace. Nigeria, whether we like it or not, deserves institutional revolution for it to be. Revolution in what sense? Tolerance, knowledge, understanding, statesmanship, commitment, honesty, irrespective of who and where. We must learn to speak the truth. Like the Nigeria's situation to a human body with malfunctioning essential organs, the lead speaker for the day, Professor Mohammed Alamin, said there is a need to evolve a new class of political and social leadership by killing oligarchy. Very few people that control the psyche of the Northerners. Just like we have very few people in the South who are also either Muslim or Christian that control the psyche of the Southerners or of the Christians or of the Muslims there. We need to change these things. And this important rule, this important government can start the move. This group is saying that Nigeria needs to heal by reorientating and refocusing the damaged ideologies in the country, especially in the two core religions. And among the solutions proffered are obligations both Christians and Muslims will keep to foster tolerance, unity and peace. Omelogo Naji Chan.